I'm Sasha Andreev with Gobble Green TV, and I've got Dan Mims of the Ethical Man Collective and here, three awesome organizations devoted to vegan lifestyles. Uh, so tell me a little bit about the Ethical Man. What is that exactly? So the Ethical Man is essentially the first ever vegan menswear retailer. Okay. And it's all online, and what we do is we curate really great vegan men's products. We also make a few of our own, and we try to make it make the access greater for vegans across the country to actually get those great looking vegan clothes. All right, so would you say that the people who are wearing these clothes are entirely vegan, or do you find people from all over the board come to you? I mean, I think for the most part, it's specialty to the vegans because they finally have found something they can get to, that they can afford, that looks great. Right. You know, so it's, it's generally the vegans who are buying, but there's definitely, definitely part of the mission is to, is to broaden the awareness, mm -hmm. broaden the appeal and make it, make it obvious that vegan fashion is actually just as good as regular fashion. Well, for those people who don't really know what vegan fashion is, what defines vegan fashion? So it's just like vegan food. There's no animal products involved. Okay. So the most typical products you see in menswear are leather, wool, mm -hmm. and silk, especially for formal wear, for business wear. Right. So none of those products are in any of the things we sell. Okay. So uh, how long has the website been running at this point? Uh, it's been since, I think, November 2010. All right. And how has been the response to it so far? Uh, good, you know, for a small site and not not any real marketing budget or any any real budget, just a budget at all. You know, we're, we actually get lots of orders a week, and we also have about six thousand fans on Facebook, which is cool. And uh, so, yeah, there's definitely been a good grassroots response. All right, and then a lot of people think of vegans, some who are very environmentally conscious and animal friendly, uh, and I think there is probably a certain stigma about it. How would you say that? your fashion style and the types of clothes that you carry appeal to a greater variety of styles. Well, you know, I've, I've heard from a lot of people who work in conventional silos in our site, right? right. Business and, and, and law, things like that. And they need to be able to dress in non-crunchy, non-granola ways. Yes. So, you know, The Ethical Man has been a great resource for those people, especially. Okay. And, it's, and again, you know, as you, as you alluded to, it's definitely broadening the idea that, you know, Vegan fashion can be formal, it can take itself seriously aesthetically, mm -hmm. but also be ethically interesting. Okay, cool. Now, you have another website called Collective, which has a very yes. interesting spelling. Yes. Uh, tell me about that. So it's spelled with no vowels, so it's <laughs> CLLC TV, and that means a lot of people think it's a TV channel or something. Yeah. Um, but, you know, the, the idea is to be a little bit edgy, a little bit, a little bit on, the, on, the, on the edge of things, which is why we wanted that brand name, and also, right. you know, the short domain is great. And tell me what the collective is exactly. Right, so collective is essentially a media platform. It's vegan positive, we say vegan positive. So it's supposed to be inclusive. It's supposed to appeal to people beyond just the vegan community. Okay. It's a media platform. We tell interesting stories about people, culture, and the local scene in New York. Okay. We also offer uh, vegan friendly deals. So like Groupon, but just, you know, if you, if you, if a lot of vegans are already kind of hounding Groupon Living Social for all the vegan deals. Right. We're trying to make it so that you don't have to do that. Mm -hmm and also to support the vegan business community. And we're a vegan business ourselves, so we want to sort of create this vegan economy with it. Okay, and uh, how long has this website existed? Very, it's very new, it's been about six months since the soft launch. Okay. And I wouldn't even say we've hard launched yet. So, so when is the hard launch, would you say? You know, humans are very bad at predicting. <laughs> uh, but I would say definitely by the end of the year. Okay, and is your plan to expand to other cities beyond New York? Yes, although in New York we ought to be able to create a sustainable business model just here. Mm -hmm. So that's the plan is to try to see the light at the end of that tunnel. And then if it's working here, then we can go elsewhere. Okay, so these are your day jobs. And then you have yes. a whole nighttime gig because you're also in a band, right? That's right. I'm a musician. I'm a drummer. Okay. And uh, my twin brother is the guitarist. And we are a duo. And we're called Here. Okay. It's H-E-R-E. -E, and we basically play very long form progressive rock. All right. And it's sort of like Tool meets Yes. And our name is here, so we like monosyllabic names. All right, lot. cool. And then tell me a little bit about sort of does your lifestyle philosophy having to do with veganism and uh, I guess animal rights find its way into the music? Or absolutely. I mean, we're instrumental, but the whole we we write music that's supposed to convey a message and a feeling without words. Okay. And uh, the first album that we just put out last year was all about the trajectory of how human society has sort of we started out. Is sort of you know aligned with nature mm -hmm. and and living according to the rules, and then we started producing our own food, and then we started producing you know overpopulating, and then we started you know controlling all of nature, right. and that's really a big theme in the album. Okay, and what's the name of the album? It's called Past, Present, Future. All right. So if I wanted to find the band here, where would I go? Hereband.com. If I wanted to find Collective, where would I go? 
uh, collective.com. Okay, and spelled? C-O-L-C-T-V.com. All right, and then finally, the Ethical Man, the professional website. What's the website for that? Also, theethicalman.com. All right, simple and easy. Well, thanks so much for joining me. Thank uh, you. It's a pleasure meeting you. You too, sir. And for more information and for more all things vegan, check out our other videos on Goblin Green TV.